spit in his face, stomp on the flag and light it up. Yeah, you think you're tough. We'll try that in a small town. Hey folks, so it's been a while since there's been a truly controversial song. One that unites listeners and media in outrage at something so abominable has been created. Well, in comes Jason Aldean with the most argued about song of the year, and all he needed to do was condense the last or seven years of Trump voter thinking into a three minute country ditty. Got a gun that my granddad gave me. They say one day they're gonna round up. Well, that might fly in the city. Good luck. Try that in a small town. <laughs> wow. Well, if nothing else, this could be the very first mainstream song where every single line is a right-wing talking point. Aldine's lyrics were especially criticized for the blatant endorsement of vigilanteism, with some users picking up on the parallels to Kyle Rittenhouse. But the lyrics themselves aren't even what's causing the most outrage for folks, it's the video. You see, the video is set outside the Maury County Courthouse in Columbia, Tennessee, where in 1927, a lynch mob hung Henry Choate from a second-story courthouse window. Uh, as well as the location of the Columbia race riots of 1946. So in that context, plus the fact that the post-George Floyd BLM protests feature very prominently in the video, seems to imply something uh, to the point that even CMT, the literal country music channel, banned the video. And because nothing goes as well with conservative hate as denying said hate, Aldine has been on some kind of social media apology tour claiming that he didn't really mean all those lyrics. And even if he did, he was actually meaning the opposite of what you're thinking. <laughs> of course. But he probably didn't even need to say anything after all, as Try That in a Small Town has already become one of his most successful songs. Classic America, right? Well, that's all for this week. In other news, people are paying almost $200,000 for the first iPhone models. Uh, yet more reminders that you are getting old and everything you liked all those years ago is way too expensive now. 